going on, Nitrocytes? It is your boy, the Nitron General here, and welcome back to episode 55 of our Pokemon Showdown series. If you guys are excited for this, make sure to leave a like down below and subscribe if you guys are new to help me hit my very ambitious goal of 300 subscribers by the end of the year. Um, if you guys haven't subscribed already, if you like gaming content, if you like Pokemon content, I would really appreciate it if you hit that subscribe button. It would mean a lot to me if you would. Um, if you guys are already subscribed and still want to help contribute to that, make sure you hit that like button and share it with your friends, but make sure you hit that like button because then YouTube will know that these videos are enjoyable and they will get them to recommended people, you know, people who might enjoy the content more. But other than that, guys, yeah, so you guys have definitely seen some changes on the channel here in the last week, and I have not had time to address these changes yet because I have done all of my recording in bulk uh, a few days ago before a lot of these changes went down. Now, obviously, in the last few Pokemon Showdown videos, I didn't mention it, but obviously, I have found out a way to get this whole thing full screen, which I have not uh, figured out a way, but I did now, and it looks more professional, looks nice, I'm really happy about that. We also have an intro on the channel, which is really, really cool. It is not great. It's not a perfect intro, but I think it'll do really well until I can get like a professional one made someday. But I think this one will be good for now. Um, we might change it up from time to time. I think it's really cool. Um, obviously, I made it, and I am no uh, tech wizard, so it is just like a very mediocre um, intro. But it'll work great, and obviously, you guys are seeing you know graphics and stuff which i'm not sure if the graphic down there is still up or not uh but you know you got the graphics to say like and subscribe you got the ones at the end of the video i can throw up pictures if i wanted to throw up a really realistic creepy realistic picture of a pokemon on the screen right now like this right there like the one that's going on right there um like isn't that like super creepy realistic like i could throw i could throw that up if i want to i have no idea what's on the screen right now but i'm imagining it's going to be like the creepiest thing you guys have ever seen in future me, do not forget to put that picture in the video, because otherwise this entire bit's going to be extremely awkward. But, yeah, so we have an editing software now that I actually splurged and bought a subscription to. I'm taking these videos extremely serious, guys. When I said at the beginning of the year that 2021 was going to be the best year for the channel, um, I wasn't kidding. It's going to be the best year for the channel, and I'm extremely excited for what's going to be happening, and now that we have an editing software and everything like that, you know, it's, it's like, really, we're really getting into it, guys, we got, we can add anything we want, all that kind of good stuff, and the videos are going to be much more quiet, higher quality moving forward than they ever were before, so make sure you guys hit that like button if you you are excited. But without further ado, guys, let's just get right into the video. We're going to try to get four battles into this video like we do in every one. Um, if you guys haven't checked out the last episode, which was the first episode with this new team, I would highly suggest it. Um, it was an amazing first episode. We got a queen sweep, and now we're encountering a trick room team with uh, Contra... No, not Contra. Uh, but we got Valley Drum, Snorlax. I don't know what Guzzlord does because... I have never once seen this thing used competitively. Um, obviously, okay, well, I don't assume we're gonna win this one very easily. Um, I do think that if we go, they do have two trick room setters. I do think we go geyser and we go, actually, do I go geyser? He's good against a couple of the mons here. If I imagine which ones he would lead with, I'd imagine it would be Hatterene and Snorlax. Um, so I kind of want to go Black Bolt and Frozone here. Um, oh, now I understand why I wanted to go... Oh, well, they go Dusclops to set it up. Okay. All right. All right. I see you. I see you. Well, we're going to hit that Shuckle with a close combat here. And we're going to just Night Slash the uh, Dusclops since we have no other option since we cannot fake out the Dusclops. Because I was hoping they would leave with Hatterene so I could fake out the Hatterene and prevent the Trick Room from going up. But, unfortunately, we cannot do that. So, Chuck, Chuck, oh, oh, wow, that was a crit. That was a lot of damage. They do get the Trick Room up, which is going to suck. It is going to suck. I do think I just want to try to go for a Plasma Fist here and Shuckle. We are infestation. We are infested, which means you can't leave. 
I'm gonna go for a night slash into dust claps. Um, I don't know what it wants to do. It goes for a will of the wisp, so they're gonna let their dust claps go down. What? Oh, are you kidding me? Okay. Well, who do we want to take out here, right? Who is the bigger threat? Um, I do think. Uh, I don't know. See, I think we go for a plasma fit. We're going to go for Plasma Fist into those claps, just in case they do decide to switch it out. And then I am just going to go for a, an Ice Shard into Shuckle here. It's our best bet. Shuckle does go down. I don't have to worry about that. He does go for Will of the Wisps. I imagine that's what he was going to. But I, if he decided to switch out, we were going to hit something with a Plasma Fist. Now, they do only have one other Pokemon to set up Trick Room once this goes down. I don't imagine they send it out. I'm, I imagine it's probably something along the, line, along the lines of Rhyperior Snorlax. Yeah, well, obviously, and I can't really hit anything for super effective right now because I could try to go for a close combat on that Snorlax, but at the same time, I really can't. I can go for a triple axle onto um, Rhyperior here. Oh, he went for... I saw that coming, and I was like, crap! That sucks. Oh, well, big... Uh, uh, we get a triple axle off that does not do anything, really, at all, um, unfortunately... I have to go Geyser, and we have to go... I really want to go look at Lincoln Logs here, so I kind of got to go... Uh, we kind of go, gotta go Shadow and try to Draco, but... So I'm just going to go for a Focus Blast on the Snorlax here, and we're going to go for a Draco on the Rhyperior. Um, this is really not looking good for our first battle here. Oh, Ice Punch. Wow. Um... I did not expect Ice Punch on a Snorlax. I have never once seen that. And it missed. It missed. God dang it. I really... Well, in, in that in the, our team builder there, I talked about it. I was really nervous about Geyser having two moves that have a decent chance to miss. You know, as MNJTV always says, if it's not 100% accurate, it's 50. Well... See, and this is what I don't understand. Oh my. Why? 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 God, you're missing again, Geyser? Wow. That, okay. Well, um. Geyser missed two focus blasts in a row. Two focus blasts. Makes me want to give him the blunder policy. Really, really, really does. But we're going to go for a Toxic on that Snorlax. And I'm just going to go for a Body Press on the Rhyperior. I, I kind of, well... What if I just go for a Moon Blast on the Rhyperior and I go for a Body Press on the Snorlax, actually? That might be smarter. Um, oh, man, that Brick Break. Why does this Snorlax have so many stupid moves that I've never seen before? And then this, this is where... So I gotta go for a Moon Blast on Snorlax, and you, you're you probably 56. If I'm 62, I'm a little bit faster if I go for an Iron Head, um, which is fine, but at the same time, I need to go for an Iron Head and a Hatterene. It is sashed. It is sashed, so they get up Trick Room. Oh, it flinched! They flinched! Yo! That's awesome. Okay, well, let's go for a Moon Blast, and then we go for um, a Body Press. Either way... They can't get up Trick Room here. This actually, actually guys, oh my god, please tell me we can bring this one back. I didn't think we could, but we are faster. Okay, so the Hatterene goes down. They do not get Trick Room up. I am faster than the Snorlax. We take it out. Now it is Pixie and Lincoln Logs versus Guzzlord. We get a Beast Boost up. Come on. Come on, you're... Oh my god, this is going to be four times effective. This is going to be four times effective. I should... I. Uh, we're gonna go for body press. Let's go! We brought this back. GG's to Canil Evergreen. It's a cool sprite. I don't. Is it, isn't that from uh, uh, Diamond Pearl and Platinum? Isn't she like one of the the people from the like the battle place? I don't know for sure, but that was a, that was a good battle. Um, we really kind of. Picked it up back there at the end. Um, 
definitely, I think they thought I was going for the Snorlax at one time, but I didn't. I went for the Hadrian because I wanted to try to take KO it. But, okay. Well, they, they have five Pokemon. I'm Babo. Okay, well... Oh, I love... They, they've got two of my top ten favorite Pokemon on here. Melodic and Cincino. Um... They do have, I don't know what, it, it makes me scared that they only have five, which means they're either testing something or, I don't know. Um, I do like Geyser being able to hit a few of these for super effective damage. Uh, I also like Black Bolt here too. I think Black Bolt might be a better lead. Black Bolt and then Shadow maybe. We'll go Black Bolt and Shadow. Obviously, they have two mons that can coil. Obviously, gotta worry about the Thousand Arrows. Um, okay, so we are faster than, the, well, 361, 383. So unless that's Scarf Zygarde, we're out, we're fast, right? So I could easily just go for a fake out on it though and, and ensure I take it out, right? I could see it being Scarf. I gotta go for a Draco on it. I have to. Um, I could see it's it's probably fast. That's the thing. It's probably like max speed choice Scarf because I could see that Strength Sap. Well, that really didn't help you at all there. Um, your Flame War. Do you get? Oh, you get. I keep forgetting this one. It's Flare Boost. Um, well, really, they can only really send. I, don't, I would not. Suggest sending Melodic out, right? It's probably gotta be. I don't even know. Since you know, I know it gets triple axle in, in, in the Isle of Armor, so we'll have to see which who they decide to go into here. Um, man, Burn Dripplin. This is a cool team. I, I, I do, I do like this team, but I do think that they needed a, a six member. Unless they're just trying to test something out. Are they? Um, are they like timing out? I don't know. Please don't tell me they're timing out. Okay. No, they go They go into Center Scorch here. Um, I'm just going to go for a Plasma Fist into Drip Limb. And then I am going for a... I guess probably... I guess I should go for a Shadow Ball since we are Spell Tag. Um, on the Center Scorch. And have a better chance of taking this thing out. Um, we take out the Dripplum here, obviously. Shadow Ball, Tennis Sports. What? What? I'm a little confused here, guys. I'm gonna go for a close combat, but why did that do nothing? I'm gonna go for a Draco on the. Or, I, no, I didn't mean Draco. I meant. Oh, you know, I did mean Draco. Um, but, why did, that is bulky, is that like max special attack? Yeah, see, I told you, Chintino gets, uh, holy, holy mother! Alright, Lincoln Logs, um, your time to come out here in Frozone too, but, Frozone, I'm only coming out with just Ice Shard that Cincino, but I am so, I can't, I have to Rock Slide here, and then I have to, could fake out. Yeah, we'll fake out and then... Uh, please don't tell me Sinsino gets, like, Fire Punch or something like that, right? And please tell me this hits. U-turn. Thank God. I am Focus Sash anyways, but still. Come on, hit that Rock Slide on it. Yes, okay. Bye, Son of Scorch. I don't know why you were so scary. But, but you were, and fortunately enough, we win this. I don't believe they have a way to win this at all. Um, obviously, I figured that we were going to win this anyways. Um, I'll go, just go for a body press, and then I'm just going to obviously go for an ice uh, shard. Take out Cicino. Um They do go for Scald here, but I'm sorry, man. You, you really don't have a way to win this. Uh, I'm not really going to try to conserve anything from dif for differential here, but... Yeah, I guess since Body Press didn't do that much, I'll just go for an Iron Head and see how much that wants to do, and then we'll try to go for a Night Slash, I guess. But, man, I I keep forgetting how bulky. Man, you're... 
you you trying your best here, but and I, no, I I uh I respect it. I respect you trying your best here. So, but they definitely did more damage to me. They definitely did more than I thought they were going to. Right? Really? Is this really how you're gonna play this man? This is how he's going to try to win this. It's just by recovering 24-7. Well, you know what, we'll just toxic just for fun of it, but he's really going to try to just recover. Well, we traded toxics. That is one. Please, I am not. This is, this is not how it ends. Yeah, they forfeited. They were not going to be able to win this. So, GG's uh, we, to I'm Babo. Uh, that is a win. It is a little bit of a cheaper win since they only had five Pokemon, but it is still a win. So that's two wins so far in this battle or in this video. So that's, I mean, that's, that's fairly good. Um, I, uh, I can't, I can't believe that they actually brought us down to a 3-0. I mean, I didn't think... Obviously, I think they had more plans for, Zy for Zydog, but okay. All right, well, they have a, a Zarude here, which I've not fought in a long time. It's probably Drought, so they probably lead with, so obviously I'm going to go Geyser, and let's say they lead with Charizard too. Um, if I go Geyser, Black Bolt, that might be the best. Um, obviously, we can hit, if they do go, if they do go, um, What's the, the, the Heliolisk looking close combat that as well? Obviously, Cinderace can be anything under the sun, literally, and it is extremely fast. So, the chances of us like so you know, Torkoal obviously is what I figured, and then they do go Heliolisk. So, I, I kind of called that right here. Um, well, let's just go for a steam, a steam eruption here into Torkoal. I just go for close combat into Heliolisk here. I mean, I could go for a fake out. But I, I don't I really don't see the need to, right? We KO the Heliolisk here. And how much are we doing? That is the most I've ever seen a Pokemon do to a Torkoal. That is the most I've ever seen a Pokemon do to a Torkoal. So they do they just go Zarude here, man. Um well, I'm going to double into... Should I double? Mm. Yeah, we'll just Steam Eruption, I guess. There's no... And we'll just close combat. I was just going to switch out and try to Fire Blast, but... At the same time, I guess there's not very much of a point. I'll just close combat. We take this down 21%. And then we're going to Steam Eruption, KO the Torkoal. Um... You do realize I am that's that's neutral, right? I think he went Heliolisk to try to um, solar beam me, but he does realize that it is neutral against me. So now we're just gonna go for a steam eruption against Blacephalon here, and I'm just gonna go for another close combat into the rude. Oh, Blacephalon is faster. I did not see that coming. And now you get a beast boost. And that's not good. Okay, well let's go. I'm trying to think, okay. So, Frozone is not going to be good for the rest of this battle, right? So, we'll come in with that, and then I'm going to come in with Shadow. You are 344, I am 383. I am faster than Belcephalon, so we're just going to go for an Ice Shard. Well, am I faster than? I am faster, too, so let's just go for a Triple Axe. And we'll just go for this. Um, man, is that Choice Scarf? Luckily, Frozone, that missed on him... Because we would have just died. So now they have... But Cinderace... Cinderace is scary. You know, Cinderace is, is, is very, very scary. Um, I'm trying to think what I want to do here to try to conserve the most, right? If I just go for a Night Slash into Cinderace and I just go for a Draco into Charizard here, they just... Why is everything on their team so much faster than they should be? Oh, man, no. God dang it. Ah, okay. Okay. It's not over. It's 2v2. It's not over, over Chris, Chris Crusher? 
Christ Crusher. Don't take the Lord's main name in vain. We'll go Rockside, obviously, and then I'm just gonna go for a Moonblast on this. Holy mother! That did so much more damage than it should have. That did so much more damage. That's crazy. Oh, it's solar power. That's why. All right. Well, GG's uh, not going to try to <laughs> win that that there. So we've won two, won one. Kind of ruined our chances of getting a queen sweep. But at the same time, you know, you can't win. You can't win them all. You can't win them all. Why does everybody have Victinis lately? Luckily, we haven't fought a Dracovich, so I don't like that. <laughs> Because I'm so scared of the, the Reggie Draco, I kind of want to go. And they're trying to do Sun V Create, right? So if I go Shadow. Should I even go. Oh, is it Trick? They have a Dust Clops and a Dust Noir. I just realized that. I either go Frozone, I either go Black Bolt. Frozone, I don't see being very good except for against the Reggie Draco. So let's just go Frozone. You know, it's like. Um. Uh, okay, so they go Desnor and Octillery, which is not what I wanted to see. Yet, I am just going to go for a Thunderbolt on the Octillery here, and we'll go for a Night Slash on the Desnor. Um, well, now he's going to see that I have Thunderbolt. Which kind of sucks. It is Trick Room. Strangely enough that it is Trick Room. Well, we can always withstand one heck. Helping hit Fire Blast. Ice Beam. <clears throat> okay. Well, by Dust Noir. I don't know. Victini's fast, right? Kind of want to go Black Bolt. Kind of want to go Black Bolt. What do they have for it? Nothing really. Victini. <laughs> okay. Okay. Well. If I go for Plasma Fist. I can go for a uh, night slash on that Victini here. Power up punch. We are we are focus sashed, but T just goes for that, which is not. Water spout is insane damaging, so I'm glad we got that artillery out of the way. I kind of have to go Geyser now. Black Bolt can't really do very much here right now. He really can't because of the Trick Room. And he's fast. So the thing is that he's going to be going like last. And the Torkoal I know we can deal with now. The Reggie Draco we really can't deal with now actually because we don't have anything for it. Crap. Yeah, they can sweep with that Reggie Draco now. Come on, man. They're, you really... They're, you really don't really have... They go Torkoal. Are you gonna... No. Okay, well, if I just switch out into... I can't... I have to let it go down. And, then, and that's what sucks here. Is that... Well, I'll try to go for a Plasma Fist into that Victini here. And I'm gonna go for a Steam Eruption into it. But... They just have Eruption. Which is what I expected. They have Fusion Bolt. Which I didn't think of. Well, GG's. Okay, well, we have lost two and we have won two. We have been in this position many times, guys. And all we got to do is win one this last battle here. We got to win it against Mew555, five, 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 right? And again, Adele is scary. We do not have a Psychic-type Pokemon on this team. So there is that. We can always hit it. I don't know if it gets Levitate, though. So, I think I might have fought this person earlier, um, because they had this exact team, except for they switched Naganadel out with a different Mon. So, if I go Lincoln Logs, because they have so many fa fairy types, right? If I go Lincoln Logs here, and then we go for a Geyser, just in case they do decide to go for it. They do Coco, they go Coco, Crocodile. Crocodile. Luckily, I did not have to go into anything to. We don't have anything to take. Alright, so let's just. And he has 
telepathy, right? Coco. So, it, they're just going to go for an earthquake. And I have to trust in Lincoln Logs that he can take an earthquake here. Well, not anymore he can't. That, come on. Move the text so I can see the damage. God dang it. Ugh. Is, is that not Sash? It's Sash? Oh, it's going to go down to the burn. Thank God. I was like, no. Well, now I'm going to lie. Lincoln Logs going down there was a... It's not good. Um, I don't even know who I want to go into here. I guess I gotta go Shadow. Lincoln Log's going down is really bad. I can't believe that they doubled into it. Why wouldn't you just go for... I can't believe they doubled into it. Honest to God, I can't believe they did. Now I'm gonna go Shadow Ball onto that Metagross, and I kinda have to switch out. If you go for an Electro-type move into me, if I switch into Zero Aura, I can absorb it with my... Okay, well, I went for Shadow Ball, not for Draco. Um, and now I kind of have to switch into Pixie here, and I don't know, Plasma Fist on the Sylveon, I guess. That Coco is going to be an issue now. Well, well, now you're that kind of <laughs> backfired on them. Bye, bye, Feeny. <laughs> But they do go D Gleam. They do go back into Sylveon here. I am just gonna go for. Uh, I don't know what your ability is. You keep going for D Gleam. It makes me think your choice specs. If I knock off. I kinda just gotta go for that, right? Moonblast, and then we'll just go for Plasma Fists. Like. We do KO the Sylveon with Plasma Fists, which is. A lot by sorry black bull that you had to go down there um we do a lot to coco there i kind of gotta go shadow here and then metagross we are 100 percent faster than 394 383 i can't remember if we were faster before let me pull this down and check the chat uh were we faster um when Yes, we were faster. We were faster, right? So unless, so they're not max speed on their Coco. So then I can just go for Moonblast and then we, we should be free to go for a Shadow Ball. Well, oh, Bullet Punch! I forgot. I forgot. No, crap. Crap! I forgot about Bullet Punch. I gotta go for Moonblast here, and then I'm gonna go for a Night Slash. We can withstand a Bullet Punch because we are Focus Slash, but he's gonna go deep. Oh crap, crap, I just forgot. He's gonna, come on, be faster. Crap, no! I forgot the D, D he's gonna go for D Gleam again. Well, take out the Coco. So it's Pixie and Geyser versus God, uh, Ganondale. If I go for Moonblast, or if I go for a Soft Boiled here, and I try to go for an Earth... You don't get Levitate. No, you get Beast Boost. So if I go for an Earth Power... Ah, dang it! Earthquake. He's going to go for Earth... Yeah. No. No. Dang it! No, we're going to jump into another battle. Screw it. God dang it, that end of this end of the video started off really well with two wins and then we just went Well now I'm fighting this guy again. Right? So if he just does what he does before What do I go Geyser Black Bolt? But the thing is is that I guess we have to go we have to do the same thing as we did before. Obviously they could try something different here. They could just try Dang it. Um, I don't really want to fight this guy again, but if I forfeit because I don't want to fight him again, uh, we go down in the ladder. And I don't want to go down in the ladder. So, 
Please tell me they just lead the same thing that they did before. Heliolus, Torkoal. Heliolus, uh, Cephalon. Dang it. Um, thing is here is I gotta go for a steam eruption into that Blissephalon here. And I wanna go for a close combat on the, the Heliolus, but I almost have to go for a Plasma Fist on the Blissephalon too. Wait, how fast are you? Wait, 344. Yeah. What? Huh? Oh, man! No! How? What? Faster? No! <laughs> Alright, Frozone. Sorry about that. Um. Crap, and now we don't have anything for the stupid Torkoal. And that's. Ugh. Okay, um, go Ice Shard, and if he goes for a fighting type move, none of, nothing I do, so I'm just gonna go for the Rock Slide. I have to go for the Rock Slide. High Jump Kick on the wrong Pokemon that I thought he was going for a High Jump Kick on. Man, we are not doing good in this battle. We're not doing good in this video. We really, really, really aren't. And then there's the coaching Zard. There's the coaching Zard. Um, I just gotta go for a fake out on it. And I have to try to go for a Moonblast to try to KO this thing. But, oh wait, no! It was not my first, I know it wasn't. I know it didn't work. I knew it didn't work. Why did I think that was my first turn out? I keep making stupid mistakes. And now he's got Gunk Shot. And I know Cinderace got Gunk Shot. But I keep forgetting that it gets Gunk Shot every time that it has it. I always, God damn. All right, well, um, all right, come on, come on, Shadow, win this thing. Why? <laughs> no, we're doing it, we're, I can't leave this bat. I can't leave this video off until I win another battle. Because I am legitimately mad that he had three moves to KO three of my Pokemon. Like, he probably also had Pyro... Well, he did have Pyro Ball, because I know, because I fought him before. And I don't want to do your stupid contrary crap. You have two Mons that, have, that can do contrary crap. So, screw it. I'm going to go Frozone, and we're, I'm going to go Pixie here. Because if he goes... Lorantis, he probably goes Malamar. He goes Shuckle first? Why shuckle? Um, I go for triple axe on the one Scott. Okay, rid of its focus. I should have has it. And then what? I'll just. I think I can go like in logs here. Oh come on! Well, there goes my focus ash. There goes my Focus Ash. I gotta go for Triple Axel again. And we're just gonna go for Iron Head, I think. Is. Oh, no. We'll go Triple Axel, and then I'm just gonna Rock Slide. I think I go for, wait, 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 I'll go for Body Press. I'll go for Body Press. It should be neutral. I should want for it. That Mew is actually insanely bulky, so. That did nothing. Oh, come on. What do you have, Mew? What do you have that... 328. I'm 383. I'm gonna be faster. I'm gonna Night Slash. And I have to... What's... Super... Why is Shuffle always an issue for me? Oh, my... Oh, it's not faster. It's just... Okay, don't K KO me, Shuffle. Don't KO me, Shuffle. Okay. Um, now I'm gonna go for another nice slash view. Can I go for another focus or a uh, fake out? So, this will break its um focus set or its uh substitute. Just gonna keep going for that. Um, 
At this point, I just go for a triple axle into the the Malamar, I think. Oh, well, I can't go for it. Yeah. Gotta go Pixie here. Try to take... Oh, I should have went Black Bolt. Because it's going to do the contrary thing. They're going to do the contrary thing. And I got a Steam Eruption. And I almost just want to go on the Malamar. I am going to do it on the Malamar. Because that thing is not... It is not doing its contrary crap. It is not doing it. Um... Okay, well, now who do they come out with? Lorantis? Shuckle. Um, okay, well, I'm going to switch out into uh, Lincoln Logs here, and we go for Steam Eruption into the Shuckle. For Defog. No, 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 no. Okay. If you guys have seen any of my videos, you have witnessed me fighting against a shuckle that does never wants to die. And it is the worst thing. Like, it is the worst thing in the world. We go for an iron head, and then I'm gonna switch out. If you go for a fake out, um, go shadow here. I think is our best bet. It does go for fake out, which is nice. Goes for leech seed into Lincoln Logs. I take out the Whimsicott with Iron Head. Get a boost, boost. Um, okay, now the Lorantis comes out, and it can obviously do. It's stupid. I'm gonna Iron Head on the Lorantis here, and we're gonna Shadow Ball on the Mew. The Lor I really don't want this Lorantis to do its contrary crap. I really, really, really don't. Go for Superpower all you want. No, 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 no. This is probably, it's gonna end up, I think, coming down to... Right, and we'll let you go down here. Uh, Iron Head against the Lorantis again, and then I'm just going to Draco on the Cartana. Cartana is scary, it really is. I can come in with Geyser, but the thing is, is that if I... Well, now I can... I don't have Weavile anymore to Ice Shard. Um, we know we're faster. So the thing is now is... I know I'm faster with Shadow. So I'm gonna come in with Geyser and I'm gonna I'm begging you Geyser here to land this fire blast, right? Land this fire blast and I'm gonna go for a shadow ball. Or uh, yeah, we're gonna land this fire blast and land the Draco, right? I know I'm faster by Cartana, but this Lorantis could sweep me. Oh my god, Geyser hit the fire blast. When I needed him to hit it, he hit it. GG's to my opponent there. I'm going to end off the video there, guys. We got, what, three wins, four losses. Uh, I don't know. Just a bunch of just crap happened in this video, including me making some really stupid mistakes. But what's new? If you guys have been watching the channel for any time, you know that I make some stupid mistakes. So make sure you check out that graphic down below and do what that says. And hit that like button and subscribe. Thank you guys for watching. I really do appreciate it. Um, I'm not going to waste you guys too much time here. Like I say at the end of every video, guys, I am the Nitro General. I really hope you guys enjoyed. And I'll see you in the next one. Peace.